to Ingredient Fudge. It doesn't get much easier than this. Let's see what's cooking. It's time for yo yo Bags 12. Hello everyone. Starting off with a large bowl and a container of frosting. Now I'm using chocolate frosting. You need 16 ounces, which is about the 450 gram size if you're in Canada. You can use whatever flavor you want of frosting as long as it's not whipped frosting or cream cheese, any other kind. Put that in the bowl and then get ready to add your second ingredient, which is peanut butter. You need one 16 ounce jar of peanut butter, 454 grams of peanut butter. Our peanut butter here comes in two sizes, 500 gram size and a one kilogram size. So that's a little bit more than the frosting. So what I did is I removed about 50 grams of that peanut butter from that jar just to make sure that the frosting and peanut butter were the same weight. Probably wouldn't have made that much of a difference with the extra 50 grams of peanut butter, but this is the first time I was trying this recipe and I wanted to make sure that it turned out. So once you put the peanut butter in the bowl, put the bowl in the microwave and cook it for one minute on high. Take it out, give it a stir and make sure that you nicely combine the peanut butter and the frosting together. And then once that's done, put it back in the microwave and cook it for one more minute on high. And you're done after that. All you have to do is pour it into an eight by eight inch baking dish. I lined mine with aluminum foil. I just lightly greased it with cooking spray so it'd come out easier. You could use parchment paper if you wanted to as well. Put it in the refrigerator, let it firm up and then cut it into squares. Doesn't get much easier than that. Now this fudge stays firm at room temperature. It does soften a little bit at room temperature but it stays firm enough that you can pick it up and take a bite of it. It is super smooth, silky texture, not super duper sweet, and it's absolutely delicious. If you love peanut butter and chocolate together, you're gonna have a hard time not eating this whole container yourself. Give it a try. I have a fudge playlist with all sorts of different kinds of fudge, including things like maple fudge, Reese's peanut butter cup fudge, some matcha green tea, and even an apple pie fudge. Go check it out.